let me give you a secret here. The feeling of not ready to put your work out there almost never goes away. It's almost always there. Before I started recording this video, I wasn't feeling ready to, to record it. I could have thought about this topic for another hour, I'm sure, journaled about it some more. Whenever I write an article, I start writing and I'm like, well, I don't think I have enough to say. I could probably research this article for another couple of days, couple of weeks. Whenever I launch a course, I certainly don't feel ready to teach it because I know that I could research it, um, learn more for another few months maybe another few years. Whenever I launched my books, I wasn't ready to publish those books. I could have gotten it better edited. I, couldn't ha I could have thought about more things to add to the book, but I launched it anyway. I have four published books now, all feeling not ready when I was doing it. So the secret of the creator is that we always usually usually, not always, but we usually feel not ready and we create anyway. And by the creating, we then look back and go, ha, huh, I learned something. Ah, oh, I experienced something that I could make even better. I created something that I could make even better next time. And so that's really the process of creative development is create, publish, improve, create, publish, improve. So, if you're asking the question, is this feeling not ready legitimate or is it procrastination? I will first congratulate you on your awareness that there, there is that possibility that it could be procrastination. Because if you are aware that you might be procrastinating versus truly not being ready, I will, I will tell you after coaching hundreds of entrepreneurs that it is almost certainly your brilliant mind that is fooling you, that's tricking you into believing that you're not ready. Because that feeling of not ready doesn't go away, I'm sorry to say. Now, you might be finally on your deathbed and go, God, now I feel ready, but I'm about to die the next day. And that would be very unfortunate. Please don't let it get there, okay? Please create today Please publish, please post, please launch today rather than delaying yet another month, another two months, another six months. Because however long you delay, you'll get there and you'll still feel like, ooh, maybe I'm not ready to do this yet. You won't realize. It's kind of like before you jump into a lake, before you jump into a pool, right? Before you do the thing that is going to have that experience, before you take a cold shower, not ready. <laughs> not ready right and then oh okay now once you've experienced you're like oh it turns out i was ready i just not never felt ready okay so the thing that i think is underlying all of this is a personal development process of transforming fear into love i think that's what spirit is really calling us to do for those of us who are creators transform your fear and hesitation into loving action. Fear shows up as, oh, I don't feel ready. Oh, I'm doubtful whether I have enough to say. Oh, I really don't know what people are gonna think of this. Oh, I could probably research this for another few months or a few days or a few hours or whatever it may be. Oh, I don't think I'm ready to record this because I could probably go take a walk around the neighborhood and then maybe I'll feel more ready. And you come back later and it's time to record. Ah, oh, maybe I should have lunch first. Mm, maybe I should take a nap first. Uh, yeah, maybe I should do my emails first. It, 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 there's always another reason that your brilliant mind will give you, for, oh, you're not ready to do this yet because the feeling of not ready never goes away and you will have to jump into the pool. You will have to turn on the faucet. You will have to take that step. And when you do, you've just given yourself an incredibly precious experience of noticing the feeling of not ready and doing it anyway. And that experience is what I've experienced over a thousand times now and what you will have to experience as a creator, not ready, but I'm doing it anyway. So in fact, 
what I've learned now is to, is to notice the feeling of not ready and take it as a signal to go ahead and press record, to go ahead and start writing even if I have nothing to say, to go ahead and launch even if I don't think, it, I think it'll be embarrassing. I take the hesitation as a signal for action. And once I've noticed that and I keep doing it again and again, now, I, now it's a practice for me. Oh, I'm hesitating. That means I've got to take action. So that's the creator's journey. That's the creator's life. And gratefully, that's also the creator's reward. You get rewarded based on, look, look at all my work is out there. I get to learn from what's working and what's not. Transform hesitation into action. Transform fear into love. Love means to show up. Show up as your as your authentic self. Show up in service to others. I hope this is helpful to you. I'm George Cow, Authentic Business Coach. I love talking about building business with heart, truly, and with spirit leading us. So if you like this video, you'll probably enjoy my other ones. So I'll look forward to seeing you in another video. All right, take care.